Not if you've been knocking it. <laughs> so here she is, the princess of the floor. Kabayeva. Competition for this all-around title is expected to be between Kabayeva and Bessanova. They both picked up uh, two golds in the apparatus finals. And Bessanova actually just bested her overall. Well, this girl's really going to be wanting to make an impression today, having had her medals taken away from her for the last World Championships. Also, I'm sure she's going to be hoping to go to the Olympics so that she can get her Olympic crown. Everyone assumed that she was going to win the Olympics in 2000, and she made a foolish error with her hoop routine, throwing the apparatus off the floor, and only ended up with the bronze medal. So she has a lot of things to prove today. was uh, one of the two bits of apparatus that didn't bring her a gold medal a little earlier this week. 25.9 then with the hoop and Bessanova got 26.37 so she's looking for a little improvement here. Well there's a, a lot of fish jumps there where the backs, the back of the um, head is touching the back of the leg. I think she did about five different jumps there, one after another, and to be honest with you, you could see she was very flexible, but none of them were particularly high or with any great amplitude. She also stumbled between a couple of the leaps, so that'll mean that she's not going to get a full combination for that. A good performance, but I've definitely seen her do better. gymnast of the last uh, few months really, Kabaeva, although Bessanova is really giving her a big, big battle at the minute. And it's going to be fascinating to see who comes out on top in this world championship final here. The 20-year-old from Moscow, just finishing her first routine of four in these finals. Six point four is the score. Looks very high artistic points there. You see, and execution nine point two. <laughs> 